All right, Taylor Swift's Eras Tour continues tonight in Cincinnati, and as you can expect, the arrival of Queen Tay-Tay is big news in the Queen City. Dabs, breaking it all down in the latest installment of Taylor Made News. That is right, guys. Uh, by the way, uh, according to my count, okay. uh, on CBS 13 and Good Day Sacramento, uh -huh. we have had Taylor Swift in the news 30 times since the beginning of her Eras Tour on March 17th. Since March 17th. Yes. That's a lot of tay And we are going to add to that right now. There are some big doings in Cincy this week. The Reds are hosting the Padres, okay. uh, the soccer team whatever it's called they uh they're playing uh <laughs> but none of the events are bigger than taylor swift's two sold out shows and the local news in cincinnati has been on top of the story they had live reports yesterday from the merch stands that opened up days before oh, the okay. show uh one swifty did not want to go on camera because she called in sick to go buy uh, merch uh, <laughs> take a look at this the Wait, woman went on she TV went that far to cover with her. a sheet Ooh, over wow. her head in order to get concert merch. WKRC morning anchor Sheila Gray tweeted this picture, calling it the best live shot of the year. And I tend to agree. Uh, by the way, shout out to the reporter Annie Brown for landing that interview, talking somebody into going on TV. The accessories. Though. No, no, you can just put the shirt. You can just put the sheet on. It'll be fine. Uh, okay. Swift is performing at Paycor Stadium, which is the home of the Bengals. Ah. Quarterback Joe Burrow is hugely popular in Cincinnati, second only to that weird chili and spaghetti mixture they do there. Chili and spaghetti? They put chili on top of spaghetti. That's a thing. Yeah, it's called Skyline Chili, oh. and it's as gross as it sounds. But anyway, uh, naturally, they, a reporter asked Burrow what he thinks about Taylor Swift, because you got to get his opinion. Here's what he said. You have a favorite Taylor Swift song? <laughs> See you. I have a lot of respect for what Taylor Swift has done with her career. I can't say that I'm listening to too much Taylor Swift on the speakers and the headphones. I know a lot of a lot of people that are, but that's just not me. Maybe I will stop. I heard the I've heard the the tour is a lot of fun though. Maybe I'll stop by. Maybe I'll stop by. Mm -hmm. Okay. Kind of a lukewarm response from Joey B. And uh, the Swifties of Cincinnati noticed. Oh really? Yes. One person commented, "We have found his only flaw." <laughs> Other people, by the way, are cutting Joe Burrow highlight videos set to Taylor Swift music. Okay, that is good trolling. That's funny. It's not trolling. They're just like, these are the two things we love. <laughs> now, uh, Cincinnati's second biggest celebrity is also celebrating Taylor's arrival. Remember Fiona the hippo? I love Fiona. She went viral when she was born six yeah. weeks premature back in 2017. Well, the Cincinnati Zoo tweeted video showing Fiona celebrating, air quotes, <laughs> Taylor's arrival. <laughs> or as others may call it, carving Taylor Swift's initials into a watermelon and feeding it to a hippo. The way I look at it, and I'm sure this is the way Fiona looks at it too, that's just less watermelon. Right, where are the scraps? She doesn't care what's written on it. Free Fiona, she's being used as propaganda. I just like this opportunity to watch hippos eat watermelon. Yeah. That's so cute. Her ears, by the way, are a little ear flip. That's adorable. Like, like, like. Okay, uh, so last week we told you how the mayor of Minneapolis issued a proclamation changing the city's name to Swiftyapolis, right. just like they did in Pittsburgh mm -hmm. and in Glendale, Arizona, mm -hmm. and in Tampa, and in others. And I made a prediction, if you'll remember. Yes. Take a look. <laughs> Next stop is in Cincinnati. Are we thinking it's Swiftinati? Or since a Swifty? <laughs> Not since a Swifty. It's going to be something. Because <laughs> apparently the staffers for mayors yeah. are the least creative people in the world. <laughs> well, let's take a look at this let's map that was sent out by the city. Look at the top. I wish we could see it. It says the Swift and Natty oh. weekend event map. I knew it! Swift and Natty. Swift and Natty. But... The story does not end there. Oh. Remember, I also took a little swipe at the mayoral staffers to come up with these names. Yes, you did. Well, here is Cincinnati Mayor Aftab Purval. Good morning, and welcome to Cincinnati. <laughs> That's good. <laughs> you, you're good. That was actually, a, because it was less effort yeah. It was actually smoother. Yes. Yes. Credit where due. Not that. that was not I bad. was wrong. The staffers in the Cincinnati mayor's office 
well done. That, by the way, was his opening comment for signing a proclamation making today Taylor Swift Day in Cincinnati, which has been done before. <laughs> All right, guys, uh, no super cut of reporters making Taylor Swift references okay. this week. Strangely, there weren't many. Really? No, uh, there was one reporter, uh, I forget her name, uh, she had four in her story, Okay. but nobody else. Huh. So for keeping, do you think the word's gotten out? That I don't know, but a, if we're if we're the tote board or the leaderboard now yeah. is Pittsburgh with ten, okay, Minneapolis nine, okay. and then this one reporter with four huh. in Cincinnati. Right. But we do have to update our tote board, guys. Because, Let's go to the tote. Uh, that was four stories. Yeah, which means now Taylor Swift has appeared in our newscast. 34 times That's a good graph. since the beginning of the tour. Did you get new pictures? Uh, yes, yes, executive producer uh, Tracy Ketchum printed those out. That's a nice graphic. And put them on there for me. And if you heard a loud crashing noise earlier in the broadcast, <laughs> that was that whole setup coming apart in the middle of Ashley's live shot. So we're at 34. Now what's the next city? Kansas I, City, I okay. think. She's making her way to Levi eventually. Yes, yes, eventually. All right, guys, that is how Taylor made news this week. I love it. I love it. All right. Thanks, John.